Hello, this is Dr. Darren Schmidt at the Nutritional Healing Center of Ann Arbor. This uh, video is about fungal solutions. If you think you may have a fungal issue in your body, um, I'm, I'm not going to talk about whether or not you do or don't on this video. I'm only talking about solutions. So you may want to look at some other videos or read some other websites about um, whether or not you have it. But if you do have it, we're going to talk about how to get rid of it. So I'm, theme I'm, I'm giving the theme of better than bleach. This is all stuff for your body. It's very intelligent stuff. And I've been in practice 19 years and I know this stuff works because I've been around the block a few times with this. I even having it in my own body. Okay, so the first thing is a supplement called Gut Flora. And it comes from a company called MediHerb, which is in Australia. And these are prescriptions in Australia. So this is a bottle of um, 40, it says enteric coated capsules. It's 40 in here. And um, they are very heavily coated. And one day I took a knife and I cut one in half. And inside is this nasty, nasty black gel type substance, which is uh, black licorice. It's the first ingredient. And it also has andrographis, which in Australia they say it's for infections. Andrographis. It's a plant. The last ingredient is oregano. So um, oregano kills a lot of stuff. It's uh, antimicrobial, naturally anti fungal. Okay, so now that is for lower in the intestines because the heavily coated gel doesn't open up until lower down here. Sigma colon, descending colon. Okay, the next one is Fung DX from Systemic Formulas. Comes in a bottle that looks like this. And this is like peppermint. And just think of mold growing under the sink. It's, dry, it's uh, wet, it's dark, mold is growing on the wood. Mold hates sunlight. Think of this peppermint as sunlight. It brings the sun and it kills uh, the mold. It's fantastic. So this is good for um, stomach and lower and also up in here. And then this comes in a liquid version so you can put it in your ears if you have uh, mold or fungus in your ears. So I'm a big fan. Big fan of the Sponge DX. Next is ADP. This is from a company called Biotics right here. And this is oregano, that's the only ingredient in here. And it's a chalky tablet. You take it, it dissolves immediately in the stomach. So this is also very good for stomach, um, upper part of your intestines. And then lungs and up in here, if you have a mold problem in your tonsils, maybe even in inner sinuses. So these are the three options that I use for mold. You can call it fungus, candida, yeast, whatever you want to call it. These are the three options I like to kill it. Okay, now when you have dead mold or yeast in your body, you want to clean it up. You want to dry it up so you don't get uh, mucus or pus. This is a little tiny pill called Spanish Black Radish. It's brown. came out from Standard Process in 1981. It has a funky smell. They grow the radish. It's a black radish from Spain, hence the name Spanish Black Radish. They grow it organically on their farm, and I've been there, and these radishes come out, they're like this big, they're tremendous. And this little pill, it changes uh, smell once you add water to it. It's very dynamic, um, very effective. It's one of our favorite supplements. We've given lectures um, twice in uh, the last eight years with the title, Our Favorite Supplements. So then I survey my staff to find out what their favorite supplements are, and number one is has been Spanish black radish both times. Okay, now a couple other things before I move on to the next sheet is um, number one, you gotta do the antifungal diet. We have a copy of this. It's three pages long on foods to eat and foods to avoid. And these are foods that feed a fungus. They, they're low carb, you know, they could still be low carb or low sugar, but they could still feed a fungus. You gotta do the antifungal diet. Extremely important. Number two, remove the source. So the source could be bad a uh, wet drywall in your house. It could be a moldy bathtub. Um, it could be mold in the attic or in the basement. Um, it could be your lover, your spouse who has a mold issue in his or her body, and then you keep getting it when you have sex. It could be from taking in too many antibiotics or steroids, medications. Um, it could be from eating moldy food in the refrigerator. You got to stop this. You got to be um, a police officer for mold in your house. You got to be constantly looking <laughs> for mold 
so you're not getting it introduced in your body. Okay, so when you get rid of the bad stuff, you want to put in the good stuff. So that the term is a probiotic, <coughs> excuse me, probiotic. Pro means for, bios means life. So here's a probiotic I really like. It's called Pro Symbiotic. It's from Standard Process. And um, I used this uh, back in 2010 when it first came out because in 2006 I moved into a moldy house. I didn't know it was moldy. And uh, within five months I had a symptom, and that symptom was constipation. So I just uh, didn't do anything about it for a year, but then it got bad enough. I ended up on an herbal laxative until 2010. And I was in that time, I was looking for a probiotic that worked. And I tried and tested over a hundred different brands. And I got to the point where I thought, you know, I don't think probiotics as a subject is even a valid subject. I don't think any, the, I don't think the theory even works. Well, it does. But the, the mold that I had in my body was so strong. Um, the only thing that worked was prosymbiotic. And like I said, it came out in 2010. Thankfully, I went on this. Within two months, I was completely back to normal. I moved out of that house um, in a, a couple of years after that and uh, did an antifungal uh, program with lots of gut flora. I took 11 a day of gut flora. That's the record. That I hold the record for that. I did that for six weeks. And then, um, so I'm going to go over the ingredients of ProSymbiotic. It has these organisms, one, two, three, four, five organisms. Three of these organisms are copyrighted or copywritten or trademarked. So they've actually um, developed these through culturing um, other probiotics. So um, nobody else has these three. And that's what makes this a really smart product. And it only has 4 billion units of these organisms, whereas other ones, like this one I'm going to talk about in a second, this one has 100 billion units. So the first ingredient is inulin, which is a prebiotic, which is like the soil upon which the probiotics grow. And then you have this, the food for the organisms. It's called galactolegosaccharide. And um, other or, um, products will have fructolegosaccharide, but this company was, went with galactolegosaccharide. So then you have one, two, the five probiotics, and this together we get prosymbiotic. Now the last one is called MBC. And it stands for Microbiome Colonizer. It's got 100 billion units of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 um, organisms. And so these are my two favorite probiotics right here. Here they are right here. So, I, so when it comes to having a fungus in the body, it really comes down to the six products that I just went over, plus the antifungal diet, plus removing the sores. And it's really like... Once you get a, get a hold of like what's going on in your situation, it's not that hard to get rid of it. Um, and I know there's books and there's a, so many books on this subject and so much material on, on the internet about um, fungal situations. But it's really not that complicated. I've been at this 19 years. I've been around the block many, many times with this. Not just you know for my patients, but twice now for myself. The second time being in the lungs and chest and heart for Aspergillus and um, Stachybotrys um, infection from uh, wet drywall in my office, in my little little room where, my off where I have my desk. So if you have anybody with uh, fungal issues, um, uh, send this video to them. Also like and subscribe this video. I really appreciate that. If you, need our, if you need our help, contact us at the office. And we can send you supplements through the mail, even overseas to different countries. Um, and maybe we can help you out.